let's talk about the false cleaner fish. So these little guys up here, these are the fucking sounds. Scout, you heard those sounds too, right? Yeah, she heard those sounds. These regular cleaner fish are a type of wrasse. They have a symbiotic relationship with a bunch of different large species of fish, including this guy, a type of grouper. They clean, they go in and around the fish's mouths and eyes and gills and get rid of any debris or parasites or anything that are found around there. However, this guy is a false cleaner fish. It is a type of blenny and it looks quite a lot like the cleaner fish wrasse. However, due to the name false cleaner fish, you might guess that it does not do the same things that the actual cleaner fish do, and it does not in fact have a symbiotic relationship. Now, most of the time, these guys are relatively neutral in their mimicry. They don't provide the service of cleaning that the regular cleaner fish do, but they also don't really have any harm. They mainly just benefit by having a lack of predators because most predators in the ocean will not eat the cleaner fish because they provide a service. However, sometimes they are quite detrimental to the other fish because of those chompers. Again, while most of the time they're just kind of swimming around not being eaten, sometimes they will take bites out of the client fish that are getting cleaned by the regular other cleaner fish. Mostly this is from the fins and tails of younger, less experienced client fish because the older fish, when they get munched, they kind of develop a distrust of cleaner fish, go figure. And that in turn is detrimental to both the clients and the cleaners because the clients don't get the benefit of being cleaned and the cleaners are then sometimes attacked by those client fish who are like, you bit me last time, fuck you. But in reality, it wasn't an actual cleaner fish that did the biting. It was one of these guys, the false cleaner fish.